Hello everybody, what's going on? It's Tricky here, and today I'm going to be doing a uh, commentary over this gameplay in the background. Now in this gameplay, I do very well. Uh, it is a deathmatch until the end, which is when I start to kind of suck. And I don't get as many kills, and I just kind of, yes, yeah, suck. So anyways, um, I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay, and uh, I hope you enjoy the commentary. So... I'm going to get straight into the commentary by just uh, asking you guys uh, what games I should play. There's going to be a poll down in the description of what games you guys think I should play. Um, that's going to list all the games that I can play and record on the computer that I'm actually using. I would like to be able to uh, record commentaries over Lake of Legends and some other games that I have on my computer, but I don't currently have my computer, and I apologize for that. Also, um, going out on the river tomorrow with my new boat, well, my dad's new boat, and uh, if you guys want to see a video of that, I am going to record it, regardless of what you guys say, but if you guys do want to see that, then I will upload it onto my channel. Just kind of a vlog, I guess, type thing. I will probably show my face, so you guys might be able to see my face. Just get me three likes by, um, let's say 6 p.m. tomorrow, and that will be uploaded uh, right then. So, anyways, uh, the games that I'm currently have that I can play, I'm actually about to pull them up. I apologize for this. Uh, wait, let me open up my folder games. So I have Unturned, which is like a zombie voxel game type thing. Or it's not even a voxel game. It's just kind of a uh, not a beautiful game, but it looks nice for the type of game it is. Trove, which is a voxel uh, RPG, MMORPG. Town of Salem, which is like a, uh, a slower game, but it would be live commentaries if I did that. RuneScape, uh, or old school RuneScape only, because I've been kind of getting into that lately, and it's kind of a game where you basically just, uh, it's an, it's just normal MMORPG. Uh, so anyways, next is Pirates of the Black Cove Gold, I don't know, I don't even know what that is, so never mind. Uh, Left 4 Dead 2, which I can try to record, I don't know if that'll work. Uh, CSGO, which is what I usually record. Uh, Minecraft, uh, because I still have that downloaded, I'd probably be hacking though, because normal Minecraft is really boring. Anyways, next is Gary's Mod, and that is the last game that I can't play, so all of those will be listed in a poll. I might uh, have a few that aren't, just because. Uh, Trove actually doesn't work, so I can't play that, I apologize. But Unturned, Town of Salem, uh, Old School Roomscape, Left 4 Dead, Gary's Mod, and CSGO are most likely going to work. Now, uh, the second poll I want you guys to participate in is just um, what kind of equipment I should get. So here is equipment piece number one. It is the newer NW700 uh, Studio Broadcasting Recording Condenser mic, which is basically a microphone for um, commentaries. It would work for live commentaries, it's just not as great as it would be if I was doing normal commentaries like I usually do on my channel. Uh, that, I would have to buy that. I would also buy a uh, very, very nice uh, external sound card. Uh, it's it's beautiful external card, sound card. It has the music volume, the effect, the mic bass, mic treble, the mic volume, and then it has the money volume, and then it has the recording volume. It just has all kinds of nice, neat little features. So, uh, yeah, I'm also going to get an extra cable for that, a six-foot uh, XLR, I'd probably actually get a 10, because it's only like 10 cents cheap, uh, more expensive. Anyways, next is the, uh, it comes with it, the InnoGear, uh, one channel, 48 volts, uh, phantom power supply, which will power my, uh, microphone if it doesn't, uh, power right through my computer. So moving on to the next product, it is the Logitech G430 Surround Sound Gaming Headset. It is a wired headset, much like the one I own right now. The one I own right now is actually um, the Logitech... Let me find it really quick, I apologize for this. Um, sorry. Logitech. Right now I think I have the Logitech 230s or something. So, that's really what I have. 
also, if you guys want to see some webcam stuff, I might get a webcam too. Yeah, the 230s, uh, they're pretty nice, but they aren't surround sound, they're just stereo. Um, I actually think they're like 4 or something. Like the 4.0 or the Quadra, some, 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 some. Anyways, moving on to the next product is the Rokat Rios MK uh, Pro Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. Which has um, LEDs, which I would keep the LEDs at just blue. I think that's the only color, but I don't know for sure. Um, these do have Cherry MX Brown switches, and the one I'm getting is a certified refurbished. So, I'm not getting it brand new because it's brand new. It's like 130 bucks, but it's still a really nice keyboard, and I kind of need a new one because mine it's uh, not mechanical, as you guys can hear. It's actually a really quiet keyboard. Here's a quick test. So yeah, it's very quiet. So, um, the last thing that you guys can pick is the Rokat Tyon um, gaming mouse. Now, the reason I need a new mouse really badly is because my mouse goes. So, which basically means like if I'm clicking too many buttons on my mouse at one time. It'll, uh, it'll like not register. So it, it's really annoying, but it's it's what I have to deal with on a daily basis. Like sometimes I'm going for a quick kill uh, with the op, and I'll right click, left click, uh, one three one, which will basically aim in, shoot, and then I'll click, uh, or more like, um, right click, left click, three one which will switch me to my knife, and then back to my uh, sniper in CSGO. Anyways, that's really all I uh, have to say in this video. If you guys enjoyed, rating will be much appreciated. As always, subscribe for more content of this sort, uh, more like gaming videos. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.